Okay, so clearly it's quieter in the studio today because Jake's not here. We put him to work for a change. He's trying out different jobs. It's a new segment. We're calling it Jake on the job. Take it away, Jake. What's up, guys? So we're live on Fox right now. The segment is just starting out. The new segment, Jake on the job, where I'm trying out different jobs. If this TV thing doesn't work out for me, I thought I'd join you guys and see if I can. Okay, what more could I possibly do? Get some more soul in your what's up, guys. What's up, guys? Hey! <laughs> I usually only break that out after 9 p.m. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay, yeah. so Jake, we're talking about yes. Jillian Michaels, the fitness expert, and Lizzo. She said that we're celebrating her body, but she might get diabetes in the end. What do you think about this, Jake? I'm a big fan of people just minding their own business. I mm-hmm. feel like there is this mentality that whenever you become a celebrity and you get into the limelight, that auto- everyone automatically has the right to just right. talk openly about you. And I feel like we all have our own issues going on. Maybe we figure out what's going on with ourselves before we start telling other people how to live their life. Lizzo knows who she is. She knows how she wants to live. And who are any of us to tell her how she should be living her own life? Now, you told me earlier you never dated a black girl before, but maybe Lizzo oh, could God. be this black girl for you. If I, I should be so lucky. Yeah, you should be lucky. Yes, yeah. you travel the world. You have an awesome job. Fox sends you to L.A., New York. Yeah. I can see Jake and Lizzo dating. I, and what would our celebrity name be? I don't. Uh, yeah. why, why not, Liam? I just don't. <laughs> I see. Why? Not with that attitude. <laughs> Their dating name would be Jizzo. Jizzo, Jizzo, Jizzo. Okay, so are you guys going to give me a job? Because I feel like I've been out here. I've been talking. Okay. Oh, I like that. I like that. All right. Let's do this. Let's do this. Because Jake, he's been doing okay up here. Okay, I've been fantastic. We're going to really put you to work right now. So, <laughs> yeah. Jake, I'm going to hand you this piece of paper. Everybody right. on Fox can see this, but let the yep. people know what we got for them. What if I told you <laughs> that you could win tickets to see Chris Tucker, yeah. the star of Rush Hour Whoa. and Rush Hour 2? And how could you forget Rush Hour 3? Yes. When he comes to the Chicago Theater on February 8th, 2020, yeah. what if I told you that, do I give out my number or this no, you one? Give out this no, give out your number. Give out your number. No, God, nobody wants that. <laughs> Just call in. 312. Go ahead, write this down. 312. 591-1075. <laughs> and you could be my date to go see Krista. Do I get a pair? Do I get? No, you don't get it. You, you get could, a pair. You could, you could take me 